Hello there and welcome to my channel. This is going to be an unboxing of a new external hard drive that I got because I need a little bit more space and I've had a couple of old external hard drives fail lately which makes me lose a lot of pictures so I've got to back up the ones that I've got on the other hard drives because they're just about as old as the other ones so anyway this is an 8 terabyte external western digital hard drive it's called my book um, has a three year warranty as it says right there it's got security you can password protect it if you want to that way if somebody tries to take it to their computer and hook it up they won't be able to access your files all right let's open it up see what comes in the box got it at best buy uh god how come every time you open something it just leaves crap everywhere i don't know if that came from the knife or from the box but anyway let's see what we got in here there's the hard drive you get your power cable and your USB 3 cable it works with USB 2 or USB 3 so in my case it'll probably be USB 2 because I have an older Mac and it works with Windows or Mac so whichever you're using Whichever you're using, you will be fine with. Um, knife out of the way for I chop something off. Um, I am going to... I thought about, because the hard drive on my Mac is pretty old too, I thought about just taking this hard drive out of here and putting it into the iMac. But I'm not sure if it'll fit. You know, I'd have to try that and everything. But um, I've had the iMac apart before. They're not that hard to take apart. I thought they were in the beginning, but... It's pretty easy um okay let's see here it's got eight terabyte of storage usb3 interface here let's get this stuff off of here first and see where it... it's got a little weight to it um as you can see Hopefully, you can see it on the video. I have a lot of things in my way, so I can't tell how good it's going to look, how clear it will be. But, um, there's what it looks like. Looks pretty cool, I guess. Um, like I said, it is USB interface, USB 3.0 interface, sorry. Works with USB 2.0 or 3.0. Data transfer rates up to 5 gigabytes with USB 3.0 of course it's got an automatic backup option if you want to use that password protect with 256 bit AES hardware encryption time machine compatible for Mac users and like I said it's compatible with Mac and PC and they also even give you 500 gigabytes of WD2 Go cloud storage plus file recovery software included and that's one year um, I think it's good for one year it's free for one year but my luck I, I end up using those kind of sites and then a year later I've got so much stuff on it that I end up either having to pay for it or in a hurry get all that stuff off of there which I won't be using that because I have uh, this should backed up pretty good plus I have the 200 gigabytes from Apple which keeps a lot of it but um anyway I am going to try this hard drive out and see how fast it is and also see um how easy it is to hook to my mac all right this is my imac i'm gonna hook this external hard drive up to my imac um i'm using the 3.0 usb cable even though my imac's a 2011 2011 imac which is only going to allow me to use usb 2.0 i'm not even sure what i just said right before i said that but hopefully i said that right anyway i've got the usb cable hooked to it and i'm gonna hook it power to it and then I'm just gonna hook the USB into the back of the iMac all right I hear it clicking on 
that's how simple it is and at first I read where you have to format this hard drive to use it with iMac well I've already tried this and I did not have to format it I went ahead and formatted it but you do not have to format it at least it worked for me without formatting but I felt better formatting it and it comes with a few files installed on it so you may want to copy those over to your desktop if you're planning on formatting it before you use it that way you'll have these files you know later don't format it with the files on there or you'll have to go to their website and download them but as you can see right here it's installed it and it's pretty much uh, it took a while I copied a, about three to four gigs to it and I did it little parts and I did it a little bit at a time and it took a pretty good while so that USB 3.0 would be really nice but these other drives that are over here I don't know if you can see them yeah they're old hard drives I just needed to get everything off of there and put it onto the new hard drive in case those fail like a couple other ones I had recently that failed but anyway it's pretty simple external hard drives are great you don't have to take your computer apart and you can connect it disconnect it anytime you want to like I say this is 8 terabyte and I've already gotten it down to I've got 6 terabyte available so it's about 2 gigs 2.17 gigs I was just reading something it's about a little over 2 gigs that I've got installed on it and it took a pretty good while so you're going to copy your hard drive over don't think it's going to be like instant it's going to take you a while and um i've tried time machine too to try to back up this imac so far i've had no luck with it if anybody knows any tricks with time machine please let me know it just it just takes forever i mean I, i'm not going to sit there i'll just figure something else out or if it if my hard drive inside my imac goes out i'll just reinstall everything because i've got everything backed up now that i that i really need you know so I'm not worried about it if it fails it fails but anyway hopefully if you're plant oh, now you can use this with Windows PC or iMac so I just I don't hardly use my Windows PC any because I hate Windows so anyway I hope this video helps and I appreciate you watching